Meghan Markle's reportedly reached out to a former Suits co-star, Patrick J. Adams, not for a friendly chat, but seemingly to score a spot on his new rewatch podcast. According to People magazine, Adams, who played Mike Ross on popular legal drama, shared that although he and Markle have lost touch over the years, she recently texted him, offering her help with his latest project. Adams and Markle shared the screen as love interests on Suits, where Markle portrayed paralegal Rachel Zane. Since the show ended and Markle married into British royalty, the actress turned Duchess has carved out a drastically different life, trading in a role on the USA Network for a royal title. But with a Hollywood career cooling off and the dust settling around a royal life, Markle now seems to be making an unexpected return to her roots. When asked if he still kept in touch with Markle, Adams responded that they're not really in touch due to a very different lifestyle. Yet, with Suits experiencing a surge in popularity on Netflix, Adams and fellow castmate Sarah Rafferty have launched a rewatch podcast titled Sidebar, a Suits watch podcast. Apparently, Markle wasn't able to resist reaching out when she caught wind of this development. In Adams' words, Markle sent him a lovely text, saying how thrilled she was for him and asking how she could assist. Adams seemed genuinely appreciative, saying it was nice to still feel that kind of support and friendship after so much time. However, the timing and nature of Markle's sudden interest in Suits has raised a few eyebrows. Her career post-royalty hasn't exactly been smooth sailing. Projects with Netflix and Spotify haven't gained traction, and now she appears to be on the sidelines as a former castmate bask in renewed Suits fame. Markle's post-royal ventures haven't exactly been met with open arms. The podcast Archetypes was recently dropped by Spotify, reportedly due to lacklustre reviews and low engagement. On top of that, her latest business endeavour, American Riviera Orchards, hit a major roadblock with a trademark rejection from the US Patent Office. Meanwhile, Markle hasn't announced any new projects, leaving some to speculate that she may be struggling to find a footing outside of royal life. It's not entirely surprising that Markle might be looking to reconnect with her Suits colleagues, especially as the show's popularity soared again. This summer, Suits broke records on Netflix, leading fans to wonder if Meghan was hoping to cash in on the nostalgia surrounding the series. Notably, Markle's former castmates have reunited at various events like the Golden Globes earlier this year, where they took the stage together as presenters. Notably absent, Meghan Markle who, according to Gabriel Macht and Gina Torres, isn't part of their group chats and seems to have kept a distance from the cast since marrying Prince Harry. For someone who once held the title of a British royal, Markle's latest moves are an interesting twist. Some might see this as a fall from grace. The former actress turned Duchess returning to her roots, reaching out to the very co-stars that she left behind to become a royal. Her quick exit from Suits back in 2018 marked the beginning of what many assumed would be a glamorous chapter. But with recent setbacks, Meghan Markle appears to be, if not crawling, at least inching back towards the people and projects that she once left behind. So, is Meghan Markle looking to rekindle old friendships, or is this simply a desperate bid for relevance? With the lack of new projects on the horizon and adventures into podcasting and entrepreneurship floundering, Markle's sudden interest in Suits feels almost too convenient. Perhaps she's hoping that a sprinkle of a former castmate's success will rub off on her.